Hi YouTube, this is Prash8910. Today I'm going to show you how to upgrade your light drive, light on drive, sorry, light on drive, any light on drive which is on fat console to latest iExtreme light touch plus 2.0 firmware. The reason why we need this upgrade that LT plus 1.91 which was the previous version cannot read or recognize backup games with XGD3 protection. The few games I can name are Gears of War 3 which is the latest and Driver San Francisco and few more to come. So to overcome this protection we need the latest iExtreme firmware which is LT plus 2.0. So obviously you'll be needing the same tools which you are using for flashing always. I'll, I'm using uh, always which are uh, Xbox 360 USB Pro CK3 Lite or Pro uh, Pro V3 but it won't be needed in this video if you have saved the dummy keys dummy bean key which I can show you here this is the key if you have saved it in your previous flash after the dashboard update which made your drive genuine so uh, during that flash I saved this uh, dummy bean keys which I know I'll be using in this tutorial and to be useful always for any kind of upgrade even if you want to upgrade to stock firmware you'll need these keys so if you didn't save this key you have to again go to that particular point on a PCB and probe it to get this key and save it so on a side note I want to tell that if you're upgrading your firmware Uh, so that that thing you'll be needing uh, you will also need to download iExtreme LT plus 2.0 from iExtreme.net which is easily you can find just google it and you'll be needing this LT plus dash 025 dash v2.2.0 pin this is the firmware which we're going to be using and you'll be needing the latest jungle flasher 1.88 beta which is here so these two uh, things uh, folders you'll be needing to proceed with the update we just hooked everything up like this with the molex power adapter you can see um, I have powered my CK3 light with the molex power adapter which is hooked up to my drive here this is probe which is attached to it so you won't be needing that this is a cable which you can attach with the xbox 360 usb pro which is here to your computer now we'll go to computer now and start the upgradation let it open up in this jungle flasher you have to go to DVD key 32 tab where you have to press this refresh device properties and your device your drive should be should be recognized and this should pop up drive is light on that means you are hooked up and so all you are ready to go now you'll go to firmware tool 32 you will open the source firmware which will be a dummy key I would say no I would go to open target I would go to the folder where I have downloaded I will load this just poof so this two will match this key and this key now you will be going to to flash 32 now you'll be ticking light on erase so this window will pop up they will say are you sure 100% to go with that will say yes now you have to read carefully this because you have to power off and on your drive within a second after a second line appears here I'll show you how I'll just keep my key ready Yes, this is the first line. Second.
center line on off yeah mm, drive is in vendor mode now you can click right so it will first erase and it will write right verified ok you're gonna click ultra ATA reset and this came up key has been tested and verified thanks see you forever so guys it's done now you've been upgraded to LT plus 2.0 the latest firmware you can play now XGD3 backups successfully I'm still not sure whether you can go online and uh, still play these games but we have to try it I mean I'm not sure I haven't tried I'm gonna try now so thank you very much uh, let me know your questions thank you